Today is a day for redemption. And I feel like I just say that way too often, but this time it is true. On the last quiz that was posted on this channel, I failed so miserably that everyone assumed I was on drugs. I wasn't, I was just that horrible with emojis. But for real, like I think if you took a 60 year old woman with little to no basketball knowledge, she still would have done better than me. Regardless, it is a new day. It is a new quiz. We are looking at NBA players, baby pictures, and we just simply have to see what baby picture matches with what NBA player. Sounds very easy. We've got two quizzes here. I think with a combined around like 35, 40 questions. If I get more than one wrong, I'm, I might be taking a break from quizzes for a while, boys. Can't keep taking these L's. Start Start the quiz. What NBA star is this? I already am just so unsure. Oh my god. All right. This looks like an adorable little Chris Paul. I think his sons look kind of similar. Yup. Okay. The crazy thing is, uh, Chris Paul hasn't really grown much since that picture. Number two, LeBron James. They already gave us that one. Too easy. The crazy thing is, the LeBron James in this picture could probably beat me in basketball. This has got to be raised on Rondo without. Okay. Didn't even see anything. You could tell by the oval shape of his head. Rajon Rondo, AKA old oval head. The man with the oval head. That's gotta be Kobe. So these aren't really baby pictures to start. The other one are baby pictures. That's gonna be hard. This was a Kobe. You could see the fro was starting to grow in. I wish we could get that back. For now, have you seen the picture of him looking a little out of shape with the hashtag thick mamba i love it Ooh, this might be a tough one my first thought is alan iverson boys normally my gut is just horrible with these but i, I just gotta go ai okay phew i'm i'm nervous for this quiz i don't want the comments to be roasting me for once i just want them to say you know what mike you did it and you're a good guy all right this is jeremy lynn i'm, I'm not gonna make any comment because i'm very afraid of offending everyone who has any Asian descent. Kevin Durant, easy. The fact that he was a uh, hatching from a snake egg really gave that away. Just kidding, Kevin Durant fans, just kidding. But th that was just an easy joke. I had to take it. That's Andre Iguodala. Man, th these are easy. Dwayne Wade. All right, that's gotta be Paul Pierce. But if like Rudy Gay was in the mix, I would have been very confused. That answer was the truth. Please do not click away from the video. Michael Jordan. I mean, could they get worse pictures for this? This is like way too close up to Michael Jordan's face. It doesn't even show the whole thing. Nate Robinson. I've seen that picture a lot for some reason. Probably because a lot of articles have been using it in a where are they now segment. Because again, my man Nate hasn't really grown too much. Steph Curry. Balling in Little League. Okay, just first impression, this is a little girl. I haven't looked at the answers yet, but as of right now, I would have said Spurs assistant coach Becky Hammond. Okay, there are four men there. I've offended someone greatly. Just by process of elimination, I'm gonna take out Pete Maravich because I did a whole video on him and I was like looking up things for when he was a kid. I do not remember this. I don't remember him being a little girl. I'm also gonna take out Jason Williams. It's only been NBA star so far. I'm just gonna say this is some weird Canadian thing. Yes! All right, guys, I think we got over that hump and we're gonna, we're gonna make it all the way now. I mean, this baby doesn't have a massive beard, so I think we have to rule out James Harden. Like, I know it's NBA stars, so like, I wanna pick Shaq, but like, it looks more like Andre Drummond. Either way, I'm pretty sure Baby Shaq and Baby Drum had a really rough time shooting on their little baby basketball play sets. I'm just gonna say Shaq. I, it, it really might be my day. It might be my day! Irvin Magic Johnson, we know from the fro. And can some NBA players bring that hairstyle back, please? Kevin Garnett is not an answer. Oh God, that would have been bad. It's not Vince Carter. I wanna say Alonzo Mourning. It is my day! Obviously not Tony. Amari? Yeah, God, yes! That's Mello, right? That's Mello, not Tim Duncan. Is that DeMarcus Cousins? This is a tough one. My first thought was Mello. My gut has changed, baby. That is Dirk Nowitzki, unfortunately. That's what growing up in Germany does to a man. I've offended a lot of countries and things. I am sorry. Funny thing is, like, I, I say all these things and I didn't even click on the answer yet. Could have still been wrong. Whoa! Whoever's mom dressed this baby was a fashion icon. I don't think this is Joel and Bead. Ah, uh, this is a rough one. Dwight. I literally chose Dwight Howard because I was like, who would get the most hate out of having a very weird looking baby outfit like this? That's Joakim Noah, repping the team that would one day overpay him by about $175 billion. That's Garnett. Too simple. Too simple. How many more do we got left on this one? Luolding. Luolding's there, yes! I'm a master! This is what I was born to do! Ray Allen. It was Dennis Rodman. I thought it was Ray Allen and he was right there and I go, uh! All right, I guess we can't all be perfect. Roast me. 
That was the last one. No. All right. So we got one wrong out of however many questions that was. We did well. Now there may be some overlap here, but I just had to do this quiz because it's called Ballin' Babies. And I think that's the funniest title ever. Congratulations, Macklemore16. But I'm very sorry that you chose to use your username for Ben Macklemore. That was a questionable decision. That is a young Dwayne Wade. Oh, we got to type in the name. This is going to be way harder. You go dial again? Wow. I'm sure Igor Dalla repping this because we know that's Chris Paul. Like I said, they, there might be some overlap here. Thank God we already got that one. The soccer ball would have given it away a little bit more though. That's Mate Ellis. Let's do it. I would say Josh Jackson, but I don't think that's possible at this point. Also, that t-shirt looks a little, no. Okay. I mean, I really, I really have no idea who that is. That's Josh Smith and, um... This video is the most relevant he's been in a while. That's such an easy face. I, it's Antoine, it's Antoine Jameson. All right, these guys are a little like older NBA players. Jason Kidd, man, he once had hair and it once wasn't blonde. Jason Kidd, what were you doing with the blonde hair? Come on. Uh, Marcus Camby? No, that was my first thoughts. Dude, his face is so obvious. All right, we're gonna come back to that. Dirk, now it is he, I spelled it wrong. Guys, my screen is cracked. Who was balling on the big wheeler? I, I, no way. I knew that was a Mecca Oak for somehow, and I don't even know how. All right, we already know the truth to this answer. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That is Karan Butler. That is Dwight Howard. That's Andrew Bogan, man, okay. Ugh, I have no idea who this guy is. This is Bruce Bowen, but Bruce Bowen as a child had a man's face. Like, people were like looking at him, they're like, I know you're short, but you look like you should be providing for your family with a nine to five job right now. Right, Bruce Bowen? I really hope this is right, because that would've been weird to make a joke. How do I, this is Chris Bosh. This is Chris Bosh. And I, I have no idea who this is. All right, giving up on him. Chauncey Billups, 94%. Like I know we had help in the other quiz, but this was my redemption. I am a master of this. Okay, well, to all my haters, you were definitely right last quiz, but I hope I proved you wrong. And to everyone who is not subscribed already, make sure to subscribe. We're doing videos every other day in the second chain. And to everyone who already is subscribed, thank you guys so much for supporting. You're the best. You know this. And as always, have an awesome day and cue that music. I get those goosebumps every